live on Zoom as well. And recording. And recording, yeah. All right. This is Joey Atlas and Nick Barry. Back with episode number 34, right? 34. Uh, of the Wellness and Weight Loss for Women, although we do a lot of stuff for men. Podcast episode, uh, COVID-19, April 23rd, 2020. I'm, I'm quarantined in the studio, so if you're watching on video, <laughs> you can see me quarantined in the quiet studio. Nikki's quarantined at her house, right? And so we're doing this remotely, just like everybody else, doing the remote thing. You can hear my, can you hear the deepness in my voice today, Nikki? You yeah. Hear a slight, all right, so that was from being up late last night and um, getting up early again this morning um, to keep cranking on all the things we're working on. I mean, I was up, I was actually up until one getting that last email out about the live classes today that we're streaming for free. So if you're, if you're listening to this, like the week that we produce it, we still have a few free live stream virtual Zoom video classes that people are going to be able to take advantage of. I'm going to send out another email about Saturday's class. But in the future, other people are still going to be listening to this because what we're going to share today is still going to be very valuable and extremely app applicable no matter what the circumstances or times are bringing. So in the future, if you're, if you're intrigued and interested in what we're talking about in regards to our virtual live stream ho at home fitness classes and fitness training sessions, please reach out to us. Uh, we will give you the contact info at the end of this episode where you can come check some episodes out for free, try a few classes for free. See if you want to subscribe to what we're doing here so that you can use them at home, at your gym, at your workplace, when you travel, wherever. Because in this time that we're going through, Nikki, isn't it true that a lot of good things are actually happening? Great things are happening, yeah. All right. Before you go into a few of them, I need to share something that's really important. Um, you know, part of my voice being different today and You've heard this before because you've known me for like two decades. You've heard this voice at various times over, over the years, like when, the, when we were at all the soccer tournaments with, with the boys. Um, you know, when I don't get a lot of sleep, my voice changes. And that's really it. Um, but there's also the other element uh, of what everybody's dealing with right now is some stress, some anxiety, uh, some uncertainty. And one of my neighbors uh, asked me yesterday, they're like, how do you stay so calm and cool through all this? Like, and I'm like, look, don't, don't, don't be fooled. Like I'm feeling a lot of this internally too, but everybody is. Um, but we really, we have to manage it. We have to process it properly. I said, all you're seeing me do is process it. I'm just not hanging on to it and, and making it take me down. Like we all feel the changes. We all feel the different circumstances that, you know, quote unquote, everybody has to stay at home right now, keep social distance or physical distance, uh, different working arrangements. You know, for us, we have, we can't have clients in the studio. This was our business here. So we've had to come up with different solutions, literally, Within days, we had to, 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 to change what we're going to do to help people. Um, you know, there's the added stressors of still having to pay rent for this place, despite the change in the business model. Uh, the stress of not knowing when we can reopen or if we're going to get some of the federal funding for small businesses to make ends meet through this time because of all the changes. And then the personal challenges. My daughter's at home having to do high school at home now. Um, you know, it goes on and on for all of us. It's not just me, everybody. But on that note, we have to, we have to, be, you know, look at this and say, okay, like this is what life is bringing us all right now. So what can we do here to create positivity and go with the flow instead of resisting it mentally and physically, right? If we resist it mentally and physically, we cause even more anxiety, more stress, more wear and tear on our bodies and our spirits. When in reality, like there's so much good that, that is coming out of this and will come out of this, but 
you have to be willing to lean into it and start thinking, okay, here's what we have right now. What can we do with what we have that maybe didn't even exist before? Right. And so I, I, you know, explained this to my neighbor and they were like, ah, I didn't even think about it that way. Like I already, they said, I already feel less stress and anxiety right now. Just, just hearing that. And it's the truth. This is for everybody. It's just simply a way of thinking about our outside circumstances and what we can do uh, as a response to the outside circumstances, right? So, but a response takes thought. We can't just react. We have to give a, a well-thought response. And so that's, what, that's part of what we're doing. So I'm going to hand the mic over to you and let you talk a little bit about that before we get into our topic today of the three keys to home fitness success. So before we get into those, is there anything you want to say, add, chime in on with that? I think, I think that's awesome. I think everyone needs to hear that. Even people that know need to be reminded, like, we are, you're okay. Like, we, we'll figure this out. You've, you've gotten past things and through things, and, and this is something that we'll, uh, we'll get through and, and have the, you know, we've got the tools in our toolbox. They may just have to be used in different ways than we, than we have before. Um, so yeah, I think that's perfect. I will probably get into everything that I'm going to speak about. Um, so I don't want to jump too much into it, but the online classes and the online personal training has been awesome. Yeah. It's been really, really awesome, especially for people. And again, we'll probably talk about this, but for people that have hated working out at home or can't work out at home or when they travel and they don't have anything to work out with, um, we're, we're breaking down some barriers and we're able to get when we do are able to open that studio and you know I'm able to hang out with you over there and not just you by yourself um, and all of our clients are right you know it's it's that's the foundation and then you can now supplement while they're traveling and they already have that in the Rolodex of yeah I can do it because I have exactly and now because we've been forced to create this online interaction and continuance of training people because we've been sharing the, some, of, some of them for free, we're getting people now that are like, I really like this. Actually, I love it. I want more of it, right? So this is something new that has grown out of what we're doing. We just didn't move on this until we were forced to now, which again, it's a positive thing, which is coming at us that didn't exist before, which we're going to actually turn into something we offer people to continue to do with us it's basically an extension of our coaching and our studio philosophy and methods brought to people's homes no, no matter where they are in the world and no matter what time it is. The other part of this is because we've been sharing things online in a more open uh, and, and free sharing way, uh, some cool things are happening. And I'll, I'll keep it short because we, we're on a time schedule here. I had a high school buddy see me on a Facebook live of me in the kitchen, just cooking some simple, healthy recipes. And he reached out. He's like, he's like, what the heck? He's like, you look awesome. Like, you know, we went to high school 25 or actually 30 years ago. He said, you look phenomenal. I need your help. I'm suffering bad and I want you to help me. So we've exchanged emails already and he needs help for sure. But the cool thing is he realizes that I can help him. And he's going to let me help him. And I'm going to, he's going to be an awesome success story. Like really awesome. Um, I had another friend reach out who is basically had her world turned upside down because of an injury combined with uh, this whole scenario we're going through. And she's, we're going to talk about this on the three, three keys to home fitness success. Her, her mind is in a place that she doesn't even realize her mind is in. And once I take her mind into a different place, like her whole vision and paradigm is going to change. And this whole situation that she thinks she's in is going to have a whole different look and meaning, which we're going to talk about more. So lots of good things are coming from what we're doing and sharing and spreading out there. So are we ready to get into the three keys to home fitness success? You're going to do it. All right. We're ready for number one. I'm in number one. Number one. Now we're talking about this because... Literally, almost the whole world has been forced to switch to doing fitness at home. Now, for all of us who've already been doing it, not a problem. For everybody who's been used to going elsewhere, it's been a real problem. 
Um, lots of fitness companies are selling out of equipment. Dumbbells are sold out. Uh, most of your mass market bands, resistance bands on Amazon are sold out. People are setting up their homes for fitness because they can't go to their gyms, right? A lot of these people have sworn in the past, oh, I can't work out at home. It, I got to go to the gym. Well, guess what? Millions and millions of people who used to think that way are now thinking differently because they have no choice. So there's been an automatic, literally automatic mind shift for people to tell themselves and reprogram themselves that, oh, yes, I can work out at home because that's the only choice I have. Therefore, I can, I will, and I'm doing it. Mind shift. We're going to get to that. So number one is simplify. The first key is to simplify what you're doing in order to find home fitness success. Just like our philosophy goes anywhere all the time, if what you're doing is complicated, it is going to be less likely that you will stick with it or be able to stick with it because of the complicated nature of what it is you're trying to do. You must simplify whatever it is you're trying to do. When you simplify it mentally, psychologically, spiritually, it's easier to stick with because it's simplified. Where there's less resistance to it, okay? The problem is a lot of people don't think that fitness can be simplified the way we have simplified it and the way we do simplify it. They just haven't learned yet. And once they learn, they realize, oh, okay, there's a whole different way to do this and get awesome results. And hey, this is actually way simpler than all that complicated stuff. And, and it's actually safer and more enjoyable. So we've got to simplify. Make sense? Yeah. The second one is you must commit for the right reasons. Your reasons why you're doing your fitness, regardless of where you are, must be based on meaningful reasons why. You must be committed, right? And when your reasons why have true meaning and strength behind them, both short-term and long-term, then those allow you to strengthen, solidify, and cement your commitment to sticking with this new lifestyle based on values, intentions, and purpose, period. That's number two. Make sense? Yeah. It's almost like, too, like, you don't, you don't commit because you love the wall paint of your gym, right? Or, right. or the, you know, even if it is a community, we've got, you've got options to still be in a community and do it at home. Especially now. Especially now. So, yeah, yes. I love that. The third key is the mind shift. You must have a mind shift that from the one that kept you from success at, at fitness everywhere, let alone at home. Right now we're talking about at home because everybody's at home, right? To a mindset and mind shift that takes you to a place where you're, you're going to be healthy and fit no matter where you are all the time. That has, that has to come in the form of a mind shift, mm -hmm. right? So it happens no matter if your spouse is on board with you or that person you live with is not on board and doesn't care about their health and fitness. That's a story for another day. Like there's, there's a whole episode at least on partnering up with a person for life who, does, who doesn't have any interest in their health or fitness. Mm -hmm. We're going to make that an episode. But if you're in that scenario, you still have to address it so that you alone can take your mind to a place that honors it and keeps that, uh, that value in place so that you can keep taking care of yourself regardless of what other people in the household may or may not want to do or value or where their mindset is. Mm -hmm. so we have to have a mind shift that puts you in a place to be able to dictate the directions and the thoughts and the values of your own mind so that your actions and the things you do every day habitually honor the goals you have both short term and long term. So it's simplify, commit based on reasons why, meaningful reasons why, and have the mind shift that puts you in a place that makes you unflappable, uh, unknockable, untouchable, un unwavering. That comes in mind shift, right? And when your mind shift is in that place, then you can manage everything that's going on around you. Make sense? Yeah. It all does. That's it. That's all I've got. Short, sweet, to the point today. Perfect. Perfect. What do you got? What do you got? No, I think I think we hit it all. If the mind is right and you are doing it for the right reasons, you're gonna make it a solution work, and you're gonna find what out 
with best for you. I think what's cool is that for some of the people that have been joining the Zoom calls um, and the live the live class that we've offered, um, they're getting even more of a taste of what we do just in general. And because it is like almost face to face, it is face to face. Um, and it's just simplifying, simplifying, simplifying. People that are typically used to doing other things, when we take out that momentum, it makes it simpler, <laughs> more effective. Right. And people on the calls, when I tell them, you know, slow this down and feel how much more engaged your muscles are, they're blown away. Oh, this is good. This is good. Thanks for the reminder. So with everybody having to train at home, I'm actually getting a lot of people who have had to leave their gyms looking on Facebook and YouTube for new solutions to do at home. And they're finding us and they're finding me. And I've got these awesome posts in the private groups where these people are like, I am so like strangely confused right now. Like I used to be the gym person lifting weights, doing the machines, like pyramid sets, progressive overload. And I can't do that. And I'm doing your body weight stuff with no momentum and taking out momentum and doing everything body weight. And I'm more sore in areas that I didn't even know I had muscles. Yeah. Like I am embarrassed, confused, but so happy that I found you. Cause like, yeah, this is, this is going to do something. And this is more than one person, mm -hmm. right? So it's taking these people to be forced to go find something new, to discover something that's even better for them. And they're loving it. Like my joints are already feeling better. My energy's better. I don't feel like I'm killing myself. Like this has been a blessing in disguise. So we share that because everything we do is built on that philosophy and that methodology of simplifying, make it gentler, make it realistic, make it more doable. And the ways you do that, yes, are different than what you're seeing out there on the mass market. And you won't know until you try it. Once you try some of our sessions, then you realize what it is we're getting at. Yeah. And speaking of trying sessions, we are getting on a live Zoom call in 20 minutes. That is going to be 12 o'clock, April 23rd, 2020, uh, Eastern Standard Time. Um, so Joey and I are going to get off of this call and that way we can start our group class. However, we need to let you know also how to find the classes if you're not watching. So we, you can find us on Facebook. We're actually live streaming there now. Actually, that's why you probably heard a little bit of the audio. Um, Minerva is tuning in from Zambia. Nice. That's it. Awesome. Um, so you can find us on Facebook, Sculptafit, S-C-U-L-P-T-A-F-I-T. Um, website, Joey, what would be the best? Fitnesstraining.live? Uh, so fitnesstraining.live will give you a bunch of freebies. You'll get some of our live stream classes that have been recorded, at least one or two of them. You'll get updates on all these podcast episodes, plus a bunch of other surprise freebies that we'll, we're going to be sending out along the way. And you'll get a chance to sign up for a complete total access video portal on demand to get everything we've built up and everything we produce new for private client members in the portal anywhere in the world. You'll get a special offer on that if you want to sign up to, to like become part of our world and follow this new path of fitness and wellness toward health and longevity you'll be able to do that. And from there, it, once you find those links, you'll be able to reach out to us if you're local and you wanna come in once, once everybody's allowed to come back into the studio and life resumes. Locally, you can come in here for joining our small group classes and trainings. You can sign up for one-on-one -on -one personal training. You can reach out to us about private remote coaching. We do personal private one-on-one -on -one remote coaching and personal training long distance as well. Uh, we have all kinds of options for you now, regardless of geography and regardless of time. So we can help you no matter where you are, what time it is, and our corporate offerings as well for workplace wellness and corporate fitness. We've got solutions for that, especially now that a lot of workers are remote and most will remain remote even after this whole thing passes. There's going to be a new workplace scenario that unfolds right in front of our eyes as a result of this in a good way, a very good way. Uh, that's really it. Fitnesstraining.live is the best place to, to go. You can also uh, sculptorfit.com if you want the local website. And that's really it. Any of those will start getting you the links and the resources that you need, and it'll be a way for you to connect with us. Yeah. Awesome. That's it. Episode number 34 is in the books. Three keys to home fitness success, which you can use for life, even out of the home, because the principles apply anywhere, anytime. That's 34. As always, we appreciate you tuning in. Peace, love, and light. Stay safe, stay strong, stay sane. 
We will get there. We will be better because of all this. Uh -huh. See you next time.